for uh, Kim Jong-un, the New Year's Day speech has become somewhat an annual ritual. And here in Seoul, officials do keep a close watch about what is said. This is his third New Year's speech since he took power after his father's death. In the first speech he gave two years ago, the main topic was trying to improve the economy. Last year, after the purge of his uncle, he spent a lot of time emphasizing stability and the importance in the role of the Workers' Party. Today, the focus was clearly on improved relations with the South. Uh, today, Kim Jong-un said, through increased dialogue and exchanges with the South, a great transformation and reform would take place this year in ties with its neighbor. He said if conditions were met, a summit meeting with the South Korean president could also be considered. It's unclear how much of the speech was just rhetoric or such a summit meeting could take place. And perhaps one shouldn't take all what was said in the speech at face value. Relations with Pyongyang have always been complicated and unpredictable, and military tensions have remained high in recent months. As a prerequisite for talks, the North has repeatedly called for the halt of military drills in the South, which the government in Seoul has so far rejected. However, this, earlier this week, South Korea did request a fresh round of ministerial talks with the North, and following today's message, officials here will be soon waiting for a response from across the border.